One of the major exposures facing businesses today is what they'll do as a result of a loss and they can't continue to operate their business. This loss of income normally relates to loss of payroll to their employees, the inability to cover their expenses, and the loss of profit to the business owner by having coverage in place should a fire occur that might require four or six months for the building to be restored, this would provide the money that they would have made had the fire not occurred. Typically, the way businesses protect this income stream is through the use of a business income insurance policy. This would look at their typical operations. It would provide the revenue sources that they would have had had the property loss not occurred in the first place and will continue until the customer balance is replaced to the level of the pre-loss condition. Businesses face a variety of property exposures depending on the level of property they have exposed to fire, wind, lightning, the major causes of loss. For instance, a distributor may not have the same property exposures if they in order from the manufacturer and it's shipped directly to the end user, as opposed to a retail store, which their business is based on having large volumes of property on site. They would need to protect the building, the inventory, as well as the uh, residual sources where that property comes from.